Trill, how are you feeling about coming on this show? <laughs> Keeping in mind, you are an, you are an Emmy-nominated actress, so this yes. should be good. Yeah, I need a performance. Yeah, Abby? so I, I'm, I'm just basically acting right now, but I'm very happy Thank to be here. Thank you so much. <laughs> how long after this show finishes will you be firing your agent? <laughs> She's about to bring her selling sunset star power and Hollywood what? sparkle to Ramsey no Street. Way. Meet new girl on the Erinsborough block, Chriselle Stout. Yeah. Welcome. Yeah. Lovely to see you. Come on in. Welcome to our show. Thanks for having me. Hi, guys. And welcome to Australia. You've been out here for a few weeks? I have. This is my third. I have one more week here, so okay. four in total. And how are you finding the whole experience? It's lovely. I love Aussies, so mm -hmm. I, I haven't gotten the accent down yet, but maybe by the end of the week. <laughs> now, Chriselle, we know you best, of course, from Selling Sunset. It's the Netflix what series about the world of LA real estate. And some of your celebrity clients have included Orlando Bloom, Ellen DeGeneres, Meryl Streep. What, what does a A-lister's sock drawer look like? Um, <laughs> there's a lot of unmentionables. In wow. there. That's right. Mm. <laughs> we, we have the inside scoop. You do, absolutely. What's and the most expensive house you've ever been a part of selling? Fifteen million. <laughs> that's that's US Ed. Oh yeah, yeah. And who's, who's, who was that? Who bought that one? He was an old Porsche dealer. Um, old he retired. Are there any? Are there any young Porsche dealers? Yeah. <laughs> Probably, Probably not. not. For those who might not have seen the show, here's a little taste of Chriselle in action. The gloves are probably going to come off. My blisting. This 22 million. Oh, wow. Stunning. This is the best bathroom I've ever seen. Can I get the number to whoever did this? <laughs> I'm losing brain cells on this conversation. Dave, the only thing I want is peace. Ooh. Wow, some stunning properties. Do you have a favourite over the, over the series? Um, I normally like the more unique ones, mm -hmm. the ones mm -hmm. that aren't like the contemporary boxes. I like th something with character. Sure. And what are the must-haves for an LA home? Obviously, you pool, your wine cellar. Oh, uh, 57 bathrooms oh, is a must. Oh, wow. That's <laughs> wow. as many. And a Zempic dispenser? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yes. Now, you're taking a break from Selling Sunset and you're swapping to LA for Ramsey Street? Mm. Uh, what prompted that oh move? Oh, my goodness. That's right. Well, my partner is G Flip, mm -hmm. an Aussie, yes. as some yep. of you may know. Um, and so they were going to be here for the month of July. Right. So um, when they came through with an offer, I was like, you know what? If we can do it in July, um, let's. Because I was off from Selling Sunset. So, of course. Yeah. So if you're free, you can just sort of ring neighbours and go, I'll just come in and. <laughs> Sam. Can you tell us more about your character on Neighbours? Sure. Her name is Yasmin Shields. She is a, a, an intelligent lighting director, and she's coming to bring a big light show to Erinsboro. Or Erinsboro, yeah. as you guys say. Either, either do, you either involved, with, do you get involved with Toadie at all? Um, <laughs> no, but she does get involved with someone. Wow. Very exciting. Now, Chriselle, you're no stranger to daytime drama. You won a daytime Emmy Award for Outstanding Guest Performer in Days of Our Lives. Oh, yeah, Indeed, absolutely. There. You played, uh, get this, you played physical therapist Jordan Ridgway. Uh, she died, but then came back? Yes, I got to come back from the dead. And I love that you just gave me an Emmy. Thank you so much. I was actually only nominated. Oh, <laughs> but but I now that you said it, it means it's true. You so. are. <laughs> Emmy Award winner and friend of the show. We hand them out pretty freely here. That's fantastic. Oh, now, yes, your, your character came back from the dead. She did, and yes, a couple much, times. Much like our host has done <laughs> that. <laughs> I'm used to it, Chriselle. All right, now, Chriselle has very kindly agreed right. to ask you five some questions. Okay. We have the cards here. Let's dive into it, shall we? Okay, yeah. Let's do it. There was a medical drama on Ramsey Street this week. Aaron and Logan were both exposed to what? It sleeves. <laughs> is well. <laughs> that is, uh, but no more in terms of the storyline, Tommy. Harold's sex tape? Is a, <laughs> it's not a sex tape, it's a medical ad. No, it's hepatitis B. They're yes, that's correct. They're really running out of storyline. <laughs> <laughs> All right, wow. let's jump into the next question. Okay. Why is Princess Leia's wow. gold bikini back in the news? Claire. I think I know the answer, but I think Anne will call me a nerd. Well... <laughs> Do you want the risk points we all or the insult? Um, it's sold at auction. Nerd. Oh. <laughs> I think it's close enough there. Yeah, close enough. Two hundred sixty-six thousand. Wow, hey, that's a lot. Chriselle. Bette Midler revealed the secret to her nearly forty-year marriage this week. What was it? What's Bette's secret? And uh, the wind between her wings. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Lovely reference to Bette, Bette Midler. No, We're all We're nerds, and she's banging that up. <laughs> that is horrific. Um, Tommy, what the is this? Girls. What is Beth's secret? Uh, he's deaf. 
Yeah, well, that's... <laughs> separate beds. Separate beds. They sleep in separate beds. That is correct. We're actually one for the separate bedrooms. Oh, yes. Is... Separate bedrooms. Mm. It's weird, to have, the... it's it's weird okay. to have two singles in the same bed. No, that would be, that, that would be... <laughs> Sam, how are, how are things going at home for you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, we're currently sleeping in separate houses. Thank you. <laughs> Yeah, lovely. We do need to move on. Um, a next question, please, for sure. Okay. What television show are these gentlemen about to gentlemen. appear on? <laughs> it. It's F Boy Island and the, and the spin off Chlamydia Code. Okay. Oh. Close enough, we'll yes. F Boy Island. Yes, sir. Shell, how are you feeling about coming on this show? <laughs> Keeping in mind, you are an you are an Emmy nominated actress, so this yes. should be good. Yeah, I need a performance. Yeah, Abby? so I I'm I'm just basically acting right now, but I'm very happy. Thank to you be so here. much. <laughs> How long after this show finishes will you be firing your agent? <laughs> Short Trishel is very happy to be here, please. A UK bakery has paid tribute to their former employee Harry Styles by unveiling what? And his loaf. Is um, <laughs> that'd be a wonderful thing to see, Anne. Uh, not uh, uh, any. Anyone follow this one? Uh, Sam. I think it's a waxed figure. What? Oh, it is indeed. He I, hasn't I... changed at all. No, well, he's <laughs> eternally youthful. Uh, points to your Michelle, Sam. Did you, so he started in a bakery. What, what uh, jobs did you have before you became, you know, a star? I was in. I worked at Dairy Queen as a manager. Really? Oh, where? Yes. Where the DQ? Which uh, one? Giraffenville, Kentucky. That's one of the better ones. <laughs> <laughs> Kentucky's go. finest. There what else? Um, I was, uh, you show up and Barbie signs your Barbie at Walmart. That was me. Oh. <laughs> um, oh, wait, I was wait, a waitress, were, a bartender. Wait, 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 you're a Walmart Barbie. Mm -hmm. So you were dressed as Barbie signing as Barbie. In polyester, yes. Could you sign <laughs> Tommy's Big Jim? <laughs> yeah, yeah, now look wait, at this. Wait, this, wait, is this, is, this is my doll, Big Jim. And um, I had him when I was a kid. <laughs> and oh guess what God. happens when you press his back? Do I want to know the answer? No, <laughs> probably not. His, his little arm comes out like that. So. Oh, yeah. OK. Yeah. Michelle, you know what? Uh, Tommy, Tommy took that out on the date that he went with his not, not then wife. And that was the clincher, apparently. That was the, oh, that was your little arm. That's yeah. great. <laughs> On that note, we have to take a break. You can catch Chriselle on Neighbours later this year or on Selling Sunset pretty much any time on Netflix. Would you please thank Chriselle Stout?